Hello Lolas, welcome back to my channel guys. So today I'm going to do a little bit of follow up chatter about my review of the Sandy Kit um, by Joanna Kazmarak. Although I have here Aspen um, by Claire Teller, I'm going to also try to see about changing his clothes out to see if he can fit this one outfit and what it looks like on him. Um, but let me start off first by saying that I always appreciate you guys giving me your your views, your thoughts on my reviews or whatever content that I put out. Um, and sometimes we have to respectfully disagree and sometimes we can agree on on all, you know, on the on the topic at hand. Um, but so um, some a couple people commented that they think that she's around more around nine months. And let me show you who I'm talking about really quick. This is. that is sandy say hello all right so some people said around nine months i even seen one said she's more like six to seven months um just starting to uh, to stand um you know um barely stand type age baby they they were assuming so it goes back to um again it definitely goes back to what you're familiar with what you've seen um the type the size babies that you've had in your family stuff like that what what you what you're used to seeing what you feel is realistic to you or personal preference um i think with our dolls the sizes are quite off a lot of times as far as what is considered to be a fresh newborn what is considered to be a preemie what is considered to be three months six months I mean we all know we have preemie size babies that's like 15 16 inches that have hair that reach all the way down their back then you got the ones that you know um you know that is a, maybe a three month size and you guys are trying to stand them up or they're talking and doing, you know, with the role play, they're doing stuff that's way beyond their age. This is a place of imagination, sure, but a lot of us do collect for realism. So um, I am not discounting what others are saying as far as the kit being more towards a nine month old um, and standing up. Um, nowadays, these babies are way more advanced than when, you know, I was growing up and seeing, you know, babies and stuff. Um, they they you know if a baby was walking or trying to stand up at nine ten months that was extremely advanced nowadays it's almost normal um babies mostly didn't walk until after a year old <coughs> sorry times have changed quite a bit babies are more advanced they've gotten bigger you know especially in in america we've We've gotten bigger as a whole, not a good thing, but we just, just overall more unhealthy. Um, but I say this, and I say this, I say this. Um, for me, I think when I, I looked up the measurements and I looked up the averages, and uh, you guys are, are are pretty much right as far as the averages go from what I could see. Um, the average one-year-old is about 29 inches uh, tall um, but that's funny because a couple years ago when I looked it up for like limb size that was averaging like a two-year-old so um, a one to two-year-old I forget something like that but anyway nevertheless um, I also I, I, I thought about something and I said you know what maybe I'm seeing it a little different because my my granddaughter was a preemie and she is i i think she's tall but when i really look at her um compared to other um babies like she's going to be two years old next month she's probably what you know around closer to more of the one one and a half year olds so maybe that's why uh Sandy doesn't look too far off for me, but also too, I think it's my desire for a baby that's in between that I can, you know, have as a small toddler. So like I said, she would be definitely a very young one-year-old at best. 
and I can agree maybe we can even say um, uh, 10 11 months and she's uh, standing up early I don't know um, or she's just a preemie and she's one years old but she's smaller than the average one-year-old it's however you want to call it um, but my review I, I still stand by I think she's a cute uh, little small toddler um, baby compared to what's out here um, uh, yeah I think her feet are pretty big for the sculpt but I kind of I, I I don't know I don't I'm not in the sculptor's head or whatever I'm kind of like I don't know I feel like that was intentional so it can help with her standing and balancing well um I I haven't of course she's not you know put together put together like you know weighted and stuff like that so I don't know if that's gonna really help her more or not it seemed like it would but I'm not sure um can we talk stop for a minute and just talk about how cute he is <laughs> oh my goodness I love my boopa <laughs> I just love him so so much um I had you know a lot of times I try to take out my personal feelings towards uh certain sculptors certain artists when I give my you know my opinions or whatever um so um that I'm a I'm like so I'm not overly judgmental of their work because I don't I I don't know I think I'm starting to sympathize a lot with and y'all don't hate me a lot with uh sculptors and artists because I think I'm starting to get a little bit of a dose dosage of what it's like um to have to deal with you know a lot of critiques and stuff like that and it's it's really not not all that fun um hold on one second let me get his straps are like tucked down in his um pants okay I could do crisscross or should I just do the regular? I think I'm going to do just the regular. Because he's actually... This is actually probably for a little bit smaller baby. But I just wondered if he could wear this. Now, I would, in the future, pair this with a different undershirt. A more colorful one, I think. Um... It's just I, didn't, I just last minute decided to put something on, but yeah. Um, so yeah, it it takes me. I have so many other uh, topics uh, surrounding not just reviews, but just some other stuff that I've been been reading and seeing in the community. I, I would love to give my input on it and thoughts on it. Um, and I, I will do that, but yeah, um, I agree. She is very small and, um, I, I don't know. I, I, I love the, the big, big toddlers. Of course, like I said, I love my, my, uh, Mealy babies, Joey and Taraji, but it's nice to have one that's in between. He's, he's so adorable. I was thinking like put him on some blue. He could probably even wear some blue sandals. Um, I actually like him without a hat, even though he's bald. So I have not been putting him on many hats. Look at that. I think he would be cute with, with the little sandals. So I can't wait to put him on little sandals and stuff. But, um, yeah. So that's my thoughts, my follow-up on that. Um, also, yes to uh, one of the other uh, artists asked me about the one hand being smaller on the, the the Joanna kit and yes um this hand is smaller um I did not notice that believe it or not um but yeah it is smaller this hand is smaller than this hand so yeah it is it is so yeah so uh yep the uh sculptor you know but I think overall I, I still like the kit a lot. I love her little face. Um, I think it's cute. Um, you know, it is what it is. Uh, there are 
a lot of imperfect sculpts out here. I mean, you know, you guys know how I felt about the Benjamins. I mean, I felt like the head was extremely large and the position isn't, it wasn't so much of the size of the baby as it was the position of the limbs were too like curvy and in just more of a very baby position versus the face looking more mature, toddler um, ish. And we could probably say the same about Sandy being um, a very, a very uh, baby, um, not quite one years old uh, facial expression versus, you know, some of the other toddlers. But I think that's what I like about it. It's just because I'm more of a baby, baby collector. So I overall, for me, still love the kit a lot. Um, but yeah, I definitely get what you guys are saying and I didn't want to go without addressing those 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 uh, comments because I, I do think that that is something and maybe, you know, I say I try to to speak without emotion, but maybe I'm speaking from a place of excitement to get a cute toddler or almost toddler, mini toddler. Um, that I can have fun with that's not extremely huge, if that makes sense. So, um, yeah, I keep saying, um, but yeah, a lot of the toddlers, they look like very, I don't know. I just, it's a lot of the toddlers, I just be like, ugh, what the freebie jeebies, you know? So yeah, I like, I like that it get, this kid give me cute. So, hey. I, that's, that's my thought process on it, um, but I do totally understand what a lot of you guys were saying. Oh my gosh, I wish you guys could see what I see on this little boy. He is so, I can't even zoom in anymore on his, uh, on his little face, but I'm leaning, I'm over from here and I can like see inside his mouth. And I know, it's, it's not that I have a huge fascination with like mouths and stuff like that. I do love painting full lips and stuff, but I, I'm just still very amazed at the sculpting inside his mouth as a vinyl kit. Like I've, I've not seen such a detailed sculpted mouth in, a, in, in, um, vinyl kits. So I, I, I just really, really love that. Uh, I, I think I tend to more so um, uh, I don't know. I kind of highlight the positives and brush over the negatives a little bit or the pros and not the cons, but yeah, to keep it real. Yes. The hands are that those are, are, are tr true realities. And the hand, one hand is smaller than the other. Um, not by a huge, huge amount, but I, I, I guess not enough to where I noticed it right off, but yeah, that is true. And um, she can take, somebody asked, did she take a modified um, pacifier? Let me look over here. And yes, she does take a um, modified pacifier. She can take one. I, you would have to cut the nipple just, just right. Um, but yeah, she would be able to take one. And um, what else was some of the other questions? So yeah, I think that's it. She's 25, I think. Um, and a half inches, the average one year old is about 29 and a half. A girl being typically a little bit um, smaller, maybe 28 and a half or 28 or something like that. Not much far off from the 29. And yet again, you know, she's 25, so she's falling short about four inches. <sighs> I mean, that's a doll, I guess, you know, it is what it is. But anyway, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this follow-up. Um, yeah, let me know. I, I would love to hear your thoughts and opinions. And um, is there any other topics you guys would like for me to talk about? Later.